Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today we are starting something new. I thought it would be fun to do a live in death playthrough. So today is part one. And if you want to see me make this sim and make her start a home, I will leave that in the end card. But her name is Skylar Scar. She's a young adult. And I thought at first we could have her join the Grim career. But to go over her traits and her aspiration, she is a ghost historian. Her traits are skeptical, ambitious, and genius. She also has a ghost dog named Pickles. He is just chilling on the couch. I thought it would be fun to have a ghost dog for whatever reason. And we also have a pet crow, which we don't have a name for. Mr. Chaos? I think that's a good name. But also, this is her starter home, so it's pretty simple. She doesn't have much going on outside because we run out of money, but I think it's good for a starter home. But she only has $12 to her name, so I think we should probably hurry up and join the career. And to look more into the aspiration, the first goal is to befriend a ghost, achieve level 2 thanatology skill, achieve level 2 writing skill. So I think we definitely can do that. And I wonder if befriend a ghost can count as like a pet ghost, hopefully. And then the second level is to befriend another ghost, find a rare item in a crypt, achieve level 3 thanatology skill, and achieve level 4 writing. And then level 3 is to find a rare item in a crypt. So there's two of those. Okay. Make contact with Edith, achieve level 6 seven in writing skill and then write a horror book and earn royalties from publishing books. So that doesn't really sound too hard. At least the last part, I guess. I look forward to doing the bucket list as well. But we're gonna join the Reaper career. So she works nine to five for 25 simoleons an hour. So that's good. So her first day of work is tomorrow. And just to be promoted, we have to attend an active work day two times. So I'm so excited for that. Well, I'm gonna turn auto lights on and I'm also gonna fill the pet bowl. I assume ghost dogs have to eat, but maybe I should try to talk to my dog. Oh, I should not give you a treat. We don't have the money. Maybe I can offer you my friendship. Okay, so me and the dog are only acquaintances. Like, we live together. Let's be friends. Maybe we can play with each other. We became friends with Pickles. Well, yeah, I don't think that counted, so that is very unfortunate. Well, okay, whatever. Well, one thing I want to do is look for collectibles because we are broke at the moment, but I also would love to work on our skills. So we're gonna look for frogs in this little thingy. Um, there's this beautiful bridge. Ooh, this is a nice mansion. That is cute. I love this little area back here. Um, I'm just exploring the world at the moment. There's also another frog here. This is Edith. She's a ghost child. I don't think I want to talk to her just yet because that's a little scary. Oh my gosh, is that a snake? Okay, so she found a frog. It's a leaf frog. Um, ten simoleons. That is not good. I'm not seeing any rocks yet. Hopefully there's a lot of rocks in this world because I feel like the new war worlds are lacking that. Oh, there's a little grave here too. Obviously that's Edith's grave, I assume. I have to tell her to look for frogs again because she ignored me. Like, girl, we need the money. Come on, hurry up. Oh, do you think I could wish for money? So she found an eggplant frog. That is good. They just gave me a notification about the Ravenwood Daily Festivals. I'm pretty sure they'll give us a notification when it's going on, but now she is scared of Edith. So this is also a common frog, which is 10 simoleons. And then we got a spotted dirt frog, which is 30 simoleons. So that's good. I'm gonna breed it with the spotted leaf frog. And then I'll just sell these two. And then we'll start breeding these together when it's ready. So we only have 27 simoleons. And a part of me is like, I mean, we only have 27 simoleons. So it's really not that much to lose. So I kind of want to choose untold riches and see what happens because I kind of need the money, you know? Okay, it took all my money. Oh no, that wish didn't go quite as well as Skylar planned. Her pockets feel a little bit lighter as a result. Yeah, I knew that was a mistake. I don't know why I chose to do that. Now I can't look for any more frogs. I guess I can fish. Like there's a little pond over here. It's really beautiful. So I guess we can fish. I wonder if this is like a good pond to make money. Oh, so is this like the welcome? wagon ravenwood welcoming committee maybe i oh there's a ghost oh i need the food actually oh what are these oh i can't see but i'm gonna invite him in i know he's a teenager but like part of me is like can we age you up so he gave us pan i can't say it i'm so sorry i don't know if this is from like the new pack or if it's like just something new that they're going to give us but i'm gonna run over here and introduce myself and i will put this in our fridge okay why are you walking can you run like, come on. Well, I'm gonna do a friendly introduction to him because he is a ghost and we 
need to make a ghost friend. So she feels neutral about Waylon. Okay, he is an elder. Maybe I can gossip. I don't know if that's a good choice. And then I'll ask him about his skills. Ask ghost for help. Okay, well, I can't ask about that. Maybe I can tell a joke. Share brilliant ideas. Okay, hold on. Did she just go in my fridge and grab something? That's so rude. I just, I know they brought it to me, but like, you should have just kept it for yourself. I'm gonna demand proof of powers. It seems he's going through something. I wish I had the money trash can, but I didn't have any money for that. I don't think she actually demanded proof of powers. Oh. How do you feel about that? She seems very excited about it. She's feeling dazed. It can't be. This is just silly. Skylar doesn't believe what she just saw. I feel like it's silly of her to work in the Grim career. She's very skeptical, but it's fine. It's fun. Discuss local fishing spots. Maybe we can get some help with that. Maybe I can support his facial hair. I don't really know if that's a good interaction, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Okay, so Skylar has identified the wow eye. Oh, I don't think he liked that. Oopsies. Wait, what if I use social buddy to become his friend? Can I I befriend a ghost on social bunny? I can. I know it's the beginning of this episode, but like, let's be real. This is just the easiest way to become friends with someone. So I don't think this is a problem. I'll just cheat it a little bit and then we'll become friends for real. I just needed a little bit of help. Um, maybe we can learn his traits. Like, tell me about yourself. Oh, he likes writing. Ask about Tarot. I literally told her to ask about Tarot and she ignored me. Oh, he did not like whatever I just did. Ask about being dead. Is that really a good option? Okay, what if you you get out of our conversation. I feel like Olive is kind of ruining this. So now we're talking to her instead of him. That is not so great. Respectful introduction. Are you? What are you doing? Okay, it says Tara is an ancient form of- I didn't ask her. I said respectful introduction. I was trying to ask him. One can tap into intuition and through the readings can find clarity or guidance. Inner desires come forth and the universe influence takes hold. Amongst the Tara community, there are whispers of a magical deck waiting to be found. A secret order has been performing rituals throughout Ravenwood and their sacred site, a tarot tome shrine, could reveal some truths to the rumor. And I just won't ask you about the tarot cards because obviously it's a big secret. I think I might just end this so I can make money. Anyways, I am gonna go fishing like I said I would and then I'm gonna breed my frogs so I can sell them for 30 simoleons. Maybe I should tell my dog. I feel like if you're an elder or like you're a ghost, she should already know how to potty, but I'm gonna tell him because it seems like he doesn't know yet. I'm so so ready for my work day tomorrow. That's the one thing I'm looking forward to. Honestly, this is the death world, so I feel like there has to be some water that gets you an angelfish. It just has to be a way, right? It makes sense to me. Like, isn't that an angelfish right there? See? Okay, she hasn't caught anything yet. She kind of sucks. Ooh, what is that? A cow plant? It's an apple. Three dollars for an apple. Okay, well, she sucks, so she's gonna try again. Come on, get better. She literally sucks. Oh my gosh. It's 7 p.m. Him. Go fishing. I can breed another frog. That's how long she has been fishing. It's either her or this pond is not good for fish. Maybe we'll try again tomorrow, but she's getting a little hungry. Our dog has eaten his food. That is good. Um, I guess we can grab leftovers. Can you just catch one more thing instead of catching trash? Oh, thank you. She caught a bass for $23. I'm just gonna let her finish this up, but she's level three. Oh, she caught a minnow. Okay, I'm gonna let you stop. That is six million. So that's not enough money for anyone. I also should probably talk to my crow because I kind of forgot. Oh, they left, but I kind of forgot that they need to be taken care of. Oh, they're starving. Well, that's just great. They probably went off to get some food. They're a wee bit angry. I'm sorry. I suck. I know. I'm gonna breed my frogs again and then she should probably go to sleep. I kind of want to wait until they come back. Maybe we can write a little message. Always thinking of you? That's so sweet. I guess I can go to sleep and worry about my crow later. Oh no, they're back. Don't go to sleep. Don't go to sleep. Okay. I'm so sorry. Are you good? I know I'm the worst pet owner. I am going to feed Mr. Chaos. And then I guess I can coo at you because that's the only option. Oh, that costs $5. That's not so good. Let's go to sleep. It looks like our dog is sad. So I'm going to ask what's wrong. Like, what's wrong, little guy? We're going to give him a hug too. Oh, he needs attention. I know. I've been trying to make money for us, you know? And we could probably start our day off with getting some breakfast and breeding our frogs again. And 
it is raining. Isn't that lovely? Okay, so our crows clean. They're satisfied. I'm gonna try to discuss or teach mimicry maybe. And then maybe I can coo at Mr. Chaos. Discuss nefarious plans. I don't know if that's a good choice. Oh, take gift offered by Mr. Chaos. Please be something expensive. Please be something expensive. They left. Use it wisely. Did it give me another frog? Or did I not just sell the frog that I breeded? I'm a little confused. You gave me another frog? Are you serious? The same frog that I already had? Is that what that was? I hope it's not, but I feel like it is because it gave me the pop-up. Um, I don't know, but maybe I can work on my thanatology skill. I'm going to look up historical deaths before work. Well, I guess I'll just sell it. That was like the worst gift ever. Something I already have. Well, me and the crow are not friends yet, but we're getting there. Oh, my dog is getting a call. Who's calling you? Okay, that was weird. I guess my dog knows someone in their past life. Someone is calling my dog. I asked to fetch gift from Netherworld. I'm about to go to work, so I can't really do that. Okay, I'm gonna join her in her active work day. I'm so excited. The Netherworld Department of Death. Welcome to the Grim Branch. Here you'll learn the ropes of reaping and attain Grim's very own training session. Make your way to the scribe bell to receive your assignment and then feel free to prep for the reap by completing tasks such as research assignment, practicing reaping, and perform scythe maintenance before traveling. As an employee, you will want to hit your weekly souls quota. Feel free to check your status on the computer. Okay. Look at my little outfit. She looks so adorable. She's like the cutest sim I ever made. Okay, maybe not. I don't know about that. But yeah, I wonder if I should try to rebuild this lot just because like it's special, you know? So it says scribe for an assignment. So that's what I'm going to do. Look at her go. This is so cool. And this is Grim himself. I wish I could see your face. Ask to look at Grim's slap it of souls. Ask about Rainbow Bridge. Ask Grizz for fashion advice. Demand proof of powers. You're gonna ask the Grim to demand his proof of powers? Girl, that is crazy. That is some crazy stuff. An assignment has surfaced amongst the swirls and ripples. Guiding you towards Reaper training, Kenny, our undead and all around good dude training sim is dying to meet you. Okay, well, I guess I can scribe for travel. Let me go do that. So I'm pretty sure this is just like a practice round obviously because I am a grim turn I'm not really you know trained in this field to actually reap somebody so it looks like grim is here to like watch me out so I'm gonna investigate his cause of death um check position of body maybe I can check your temperature well all sims lay like this so that doesn't really help us maybe he got so angry Skylar is making small steps towards the cause of death okay Skylar is making small steps towards the cause of death okay we still don't know um maybe I can check your pockets. Wait, is that bad? I feel like that's bad. I don't know about that. So I'm gonna check position of limbs. This is surely taking me a while. Okay, great forensics. Skylar has investigated the sim and surrounding evidence thoroughly. Determined cause of death is now available for her to confidently prescribe. So I'm gonna determine his cause of death. Okay, killer deductive skills. Now you're ready to collect a soul. Based on your prep work, you may be able to try a specialized reap or feel free to stick with the tried and true your choice. The death was caused by hunger. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. Well, I'm gonna collect the soul and not do it lazily. Look at me. I did- Oh, did you- Oh. I haven't practiced yet. That's embarrassing. Soul collection failure. Maybe I should have done those things first before coming here. I was excited. I don't want to chat with Grim. I want to collect the soul. Okay, I think I did it. Nice slice. Kenny's soul has now been placed in your inventory. Before you leave, you're welcome to request reaping review from the remains of the deceased or from lingering bystanders. It helps boost morale. So I guess I can return to the office. So we are back. I am going to release the soul. How much is this soul? Can I like sell it? $200? Oh, that is some good money. That is some good money. Well, I'm getting a little hungry. So I'm going to use the bathroom and get something to eat yeah there's a kitchen upstairs so maybe i'll just get like a quick meal also i need to file the death certificate that is important honestly this is really cute they even have like a crow upstairs we have this little chest let's see who our co-workers are so we have soda harada hopefully i said that right and then we have this ghost zolika i don't know if i said that right we also have rico we have edward garcia and we have yutaka then i'm gonna plan reaping schedules that is 
also very important. The death certificate has been submitted successfully. I'm doing pretty good at work. We have like four more hours until we'll go home. Okay, so we did that. Maybe I should perform Scythe Maintenance. You're gonna put that in the back of the toilet, girl? I think she's gonna perform it in the bathroom too, which is not good, but it's fine. She did it. Now she needs to practice her weeping. So could you like move? I hope they do more active careers. See, that was successful, it looks like. Look at you go, girl. You're getting better. I guess I can probably order office supplies. I think that's probably the last thing I need to do, it looks like, because we're gold level already, so that's good. Okay, now I need to socialize with co-workers. Maybe I can talk to Rico, or maybe I should talk to the ghost, because I need a ghost friend, so I'm gonna do like a very respectful introduction. See, that was good, and that's all we had to do for today, so so we have three hours to do whatever we want. Unfortunately, we cannot scry for an assignment anymore. Flirt covertly. Ooh, I mean, she is pretty, so like we could date a ghost if we wanted to, but I think I want to talk to her, so maybe I will ask about her hobbies. Maybe I can do a Ravenwood gossip. You know I'm Olive's friend, right? She's such a fun free spirit. I'm not surprised that Coffin Guy is so into her. Coffin Guy? Ooh. They're both really magnetic and neat together. Still, people stare at them a lot when they're out. Like a lot lot. What's that you think? So I'm asking her about tarots. Okay, so it's the same thing. So I guess it's just a way to know what it is. She likes romance enthusiastics? Yes. It says journaling ghostly findings. Oh, okay. And she made friends with the ghost. Dead and gone from looking up historical deaths. Well, that's terrible. Okay, we made 260 simoleons. That is not good. But it is only 25 simoleons an hour. So what did I expect? But we have work tomorrow. So I can look forward to that. You have one day remaining to reach your soul's quota before Grim reviews the reaping report. I mean, it's my first day of work. So I assume I'm fine. I, I did one soul quota. So the crow is clean and satisfied. But I am going to socialize with them a lot more. And then sin on crow collective recon mission. Don't know what that means, but I'll do it. Ooh, Olive is calling me. Once again, I am asking for your support for the rock your body and my neighborhood action plan. I guess. Are you serious? I feel like the crows leave too much. I'll just practice writing because- Oh, Reapers Creepers training manual installment. Maybe that's what I'll do. I mean, I am a grim turn, so I feel like I don't know much, but- Um, my love is not for sale. Well, our crow is back if we want to talk to her. I guess I can stop writing so I can talk to my crow. Oh, I just hung up on Bess. That's a mistake. Are you serious? You left as soon as I wanted to talk to you? I swear, that's not right. I guess I can continue my writing. Oh, now you want to come back? Please don't leave us. I'm going to show you affection. I'm going to teach mimicry. And then I'm going to clean the perch. Okay, she left as soon as I put her down. What is wrong with you? Care to attend the moon revelry with me? If I say okay, is it going to load me into like a different lot? Yes. I'm pretty sure I'm in the area where it happens, right? Or that could be the other area. I'm not sure. It might be the other area. I should probably probably get out of this outfit. Also, it's raining. Like, it's terrible weather. Oh, so yeah, this is like the countryside. So it's the other neighborhood. And it's over here. Well, I guess there's free food. So that's good. Ooh, they have some nice pizza. Oh, there's a dig site. Oh, no, there's not. It says rummage. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to say dig, but I don't know. It looks like dirt. Well, she ate her food and she got a limestone. That is 70 simoleon. So that's good. It's such a beautiful night, right? Look at those beautiful clouds. Oh my gosh, be so for real. You would not lay down in the rain. You're gonna get like rainwater in your eyes. Okay, so I'm gonna have her take a shower. Oh, I have to shave her arm hair. Honestly, I don't want to play with that feature. Ooh, she has a lunar charge amulet from moon bathing at the moon revelry. Oh my gosh, it made us restart. I'm pretty sure that's like a current bug where if you leave the lot, it restarts. So I fed Mr. Chaos. Then I'm gonna show him affection and then I'm gonna go to sleep. Okay, she has work in like 30 minutes. I'm gonna have her get leftovers and then I'm gonna have her sell her headphones. That is 220 simoleons. That's good. I'm gonna have her breed her frogs and I think this is the last work day that I'll attend with her Um, so we can like hopefully get promoted. We'll probably get promoted and maybe next episode we can like maybe focus on the tarot cards as well. Emergency. There's an afterlife emergency. The netherworld portal has malfunctioned causing things from the other side to spill over into the world. 
help. Grim really needs your help to get things back in order. Hazard pay not included. Oh, well, that's a choice. Well, I did my promotion task, so that's good. But yeah, it looks a little weird, doesn't it? Oh, it's making her feel uncomfortable. Well, I have to repair this scry thingy. Expel mischievous ghost. Oh, there's a mischievous ghost amongst us. And then it says close netherworld fissure four times. So let's do that real quick. Oh, is this the ghost? Oh no, that's a co-worker. Okay, so I did two of them so far. Um, now I have to find two more. So there's some down here. And then we'll need to like deal with the ghost. Okay, so I finally can repair this. Ooh, it works. Okay, that's good. So it says recalibrate Grim slab it. So let's do that. And then perform scythe maintenance. I was gonna say I was wondering if we could be able to like scry for an assignment, but this doesn't work today. At least not right now. Okay, so we did that. It says to practice practice reaping and to socialize with the co-worker so maybe I can talk to this person I'm gonna do like a friendly introduction Nancy is calling me I'm wealthy very wealthy I'm sorry I know this is a part of like love struck but I need the money I'm a little poor okay $800 isn't that bad but bills are gonna come up next week I need to save up so I socialized with him I'm gonna practice my reaping and then I'm gonna plan reaping schedules I have three hours left of work free money oh my gosh I got free money money okay that's cool like that's crazy thank you i appreciate it okay so we have a gold medal for our work day now we need to analyze death trends a spectacle due to a technical error grim's reaping count has become accessible looking at these numbers skylar is amazed grim's reaping count is insane i mean considering grim has been doing these reapings for centuries it can't be too surprising but skylar is still blown away and wonder who else might be interested in this information sell information to the highest bidder leak grim's numbers online. I feel like both of those are bad options. Sell information to the highest bidder and leak Grimm's number online. I feel like I shouldn't do it for free. I got a hundred simoleons. That's good. So congratulations to the highest bidder, which appears to be Grimm. Oh, that's awkward. The next run in at the coffee machine in the break room is no doubt going to be awkward. Yikes. Okay, now I need to mentor co-workers. So I guess... I mean, I guess I have to wait until they do that, but I guess I can like use the bathroom. I also have to do this thingy and it says find it in a floating thingy. Oh, it's in the bookshelf. Okay, it's spell ghost. So my work day ends in an hour and now I need to mentor a coworker, but they're not doing anything. Maybe I can have like some oatmeal? I don't know if I want oatmeal. A ham and cheese sandwich. Okay, and we got promoted. Skylar has been promoted to receptionist. She will now make an additional $6 per hour for a grand total of $31 per hour. She also received the following bonus of 254 Samoyans. So yeah, our work shift is the same, I believe. It's at 9 a.m. And we have $5,000, so I guess I'm not too worried about money anymore. I was gonna go meet the wealthy weirdo, which is Nancy Landgrab, but I don't think we need it. So now I make $31 per hour and I need to reach level two of the thanatology skill to get promoted. I need some fun. I want to write my book. I want to do so much stuff. I guess I should probably leave it off here, right? I think she's cute in her little grim outfit. I didn't notice these flowers were in debug, but they're cute, I guess. Here's the thing. I feel like we can never have enough money, so I'm going to meet the wealthy weirdo and then we're going to end the episode. Well, this is Nancy Landgrab. She's literally right here, so I guess maybe we can and make our exchange in the hotel or the motel, whatever you want to call it. She went this way. But I went inside the motel. So wait, is there a Nancy Landgrab imposter? Well, that's some interesting outfits they are wearing. I've been stood up. I was hoping there was a Nancy Landgrab imposter or something, but no, there are no show. This is why you shouldn't be greedy for money. I'm just going to sell my frogs and then sell this plumbing part. But in the next episode, I am hoping to like touch base on the tarot cards and obviously reach level two of the denatology skill, work in the aspiration. I probably won't go to work with her next episode. Maybe I will one time just so I can see if I can reap anyone because I think that's a little bit fun. But yeah, I'll try to do like the tarot cards and maybe she can meet somebody. I think it would be nice to have her meet someone so they can work in the other career. But like look at her having her hands on her hips like dang, I really got played. I really got stood up. But if you enjoyed this episode, please like, comment, and subscribe. I don't know if I can post this every week. I can try. I can try, but we'll see. I love you. You are important, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!